thing on. All right, cool. Uh, what's up, everybody? Hello. Yeah, no new costume for Aki. Have to stick with costume too. Damn, the new DJ costume right off the bat. I guess I guess everyone's gonna be using the costume threes today, huh? I mean, this costume's okay. I don't love it. It's not my favorite, but it's not it's not that bad either. I feel like the sort of shoulder pads on the suit look a little bit weird. Like he's got those like really sharp triangular shoulder pads. Looks a little bit strange. Anything you'd like to see for Aki's costume 3? I don't really mind. I'm not a big costume head in the first place. Like I like I like this costume to be honest. I like I like her costume too, but everyone else seems to hate it. I like the big puffy dress. Oh what the hell? What character am I even looking at right now? <laughs> this doesn't this doesn't look like Guile. Who is this man? This costume's weird, because like it doesn't register as Guile in my head. I'm not sure how I feel about this Guile costume. Or at least this color. The, it's, the, it's, the, it's the hair color I think that's really throwing me off. Guile is like a redhead, just doesn't read as Guile to me. I don't know what character this is meant to be, but it's not Guile, that's for sure. Man, that's so crazy. I get a knockdown that's like plus 15 there. I do fireball plus early cancel into EX slide. He does wake up EX boom like 20 frames after I put my fireball slide cancel on the screen and he still recovers first. Aki ain't built for this matchup. Right, let me let me just show you that interaction. Just this this is like the ultimate showcase of like the difference in fireball game between these two characters. So like I tried to I tried to do a sequence here specifically to bait out a wake up ex fireball so that I could punish it. So what I did is I did back throw, which is how plus is this? Back throw is plus twenty seven. So I do plus twenty seven and then fireball plus ex uh, dash with the intention that he'll wake up with ex sonic boom to try and clash with my fireball, and then I'll just dash past it and punish. That was the plan there. And that's exactly what happened, except Guile forgot to have any recovery on his fireballs. <laughs> Guile is plus nine here. 
I started out with a 27 frame head start and I ended up nine frames behind. Wonderful. And this is a full punish as well. He could have started, he punished with jab, but he could have started the punish with stand fierce. Hate Guile, all my homies hate Guile. What do you think of the new reversal window? I am all for it. Reversals were stupid hard and anything that makes them easier is a good thing. I don't know why they made the uh, reversal window so narrow in the first place when Street Fighter V like solved the issue and had the perfect amount of buffer. What the fuck? What the hell is going on? All right, this Blanker is a maniac. What the fuck are you doing? Oh my god. What are you doing? What is going on? Maniac. I don't like this. Scariest diamond blanker player of all time. What the fuck? Empty blankable into perfect parry? Nah. Busted. Why? Just play neutral. You don't have to do like a hop or a whiff ball or something. Just play neutral for a couple. No. 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 Oh my god. Why? What? I'm so confused. This is one of those situations where you gotta play entirely reactionary and just punish the punish the craziness. Good training drill, I'll say that much. I'm not even doing it, I'm just waiting for him to do something. I'm not even going for Oki. What? What is this? <laughs> Block spammer? I don't, I don't know, man. No punish? <laughs> I don't get it. Surely you can think of something new to come up with. You gotta be fucking kidding me. There's no way he pulled the plug. <laughs> oh my god. And now we get the new screen for everyone to see. Username and everything. Incredible. Naming and shaming. If you were to suggest changes for Aki, what would you go with? I'm gonna save the full answer to that for later at some point. As we get nearer to the end of season one, I'm gonna do a uh, Aki suggested changes video at some point, but it's too early now. I'm saving it for content, exactly. I'm a shameless content machine. If you've watched the stream a lot though, you can probably guess where most of the suggestions would go based on things that I complain about. Okay. Oh my god, what do I do? 
is this matchup? Okay. Please kill. Please kill. Okay. That was close. I would have been in a lot of trouble if that didn't kill. Super Combo Wiki says Aki is a zoner. What do you have to say about that? Uh, that she's not a zoner? The thing is, I can see why people would think she's a zoner, because for the first, like, 10 hours of learning Aki, you feel like she should be a zoner based on her kit, but she's not. But, like, if you're not super hardcore Aki main, I can understand why people would think she's a zoner. And you can kind of zone in some matchups. What is she though? She doesn't really fit into any like uh, archetype very easily. She's kind of like a sort of weird hit and run character. I mean, there are some characters who can single hit confirm in this game, but it's nowhere near as like prevalent as it was in uh, uh, in five. It's not like a base requirement just to be able to play the damn game. I'm gonna check the drive rush. Why does this keep happening to me? Why does this always happen to me when I say that? Is he watching the stream? I feel like you've got to be stream sniping to do that. Every single time. Peace mode, baby. Yeah, I could actually make like a full YouTube video, just a compilation of hexes. I've got a talent for calling things out and then having it all go wrong. All right, I'm going to leave it there. Uh, that's going to be it for today. Thanks very much to everyone who tuned in. All right, see you later, guys.